Hi, I'm Michael Kwan for Beyond the Rhetoric. Uh, when most people think about tablets, the conversation usually turns to Android or iOS, but Windows 8 is really starting to make a big push in the tablet market, especially with some of the lower priced options. And one such option is the Dell Venue 8 Pro. Announced in late 2013, the Dell Venue 8 Pro is part of a whole series of tablets that Dell is pushing out for the new year. Uh, as you can probably guess from the name, it is an 8-inch tablet and the Pro part of it indicates that it's running on Windows 8.1. There's also the, the regular Venue, I think 7, 8 and 10 that are running on Android. So when you see the word Pro here, uh, it indicates that it's running on Windows. Uh, just running quickly through some of the, the specs here. It is an 8-inch IPS HD display. Uh, comes pre-installed with uh, Office Home and Student 2013. And uh, if we flip around the back here, uh, you'll see that the display is 1280 by 800 and it's powered by a 1.8 gigahertz Intel Atom processor with 2 gigs of RAM and 64 gigs of storage which can be further expanded with the micro SD slot. The camera in the back is a 5 megapixel shooter and then you have a 1.2 megapixel front-facing webcam for uh, live chat and that, that sort of thing. Uh, it comes included with wireless N and Bluetooth and as mentioned it runs on Windows 8.1. So uh, without further ado, maybe we'll get started with an unboxing here. Uh, as you can see, it comes in like a sleeved box. You pull off the sleeve and you get a rather plain looking brown cardboard box which you can then, the top of which removes, I guess. And this is the tablet itself. Um, I should mention that this is a review or e editorial sample that was sent to us by the people from Dell. Uh, so it may not be completely the same as the retail package, but it should be pretty similar. It's also been through probably some other reviewers' hands too. So um, I imagine that it probably came with a screen protector uh, when it first started, but there isn't one on there now. There's a nice uh, rubberized, texturized, grippy finish on the back here that gives you a great grip. Uh, even for a tablet this size that you know can fit in one hand quite comfortably. You can see the the silver Dell logo in the middle there and the 5 megapixel camera on top and it's reminding you that it is Intel inside. You can kind of see that it has a, a curved finish or curved uh, edges here all the way around uh, making for I wouldn't say a premium feel but it's certainly not cheap feeling and it's, uh, it's a nice size. Running through some of the ports here uh, imagine that's for charging, I'm guessing. Uh, power button, volume up and down, and then the, uh, the SD card slot. I guess I can open that up. There we go. And there's your micro SD card slot behind the flap. Coming around to the bottom, that looks like the speaker. The left side doesn't seem to have anything. And the top side has the mandatory Windows button as well as a headphone jack. So yeah, that would have to be the, the charging port then. And it's just the single speaker there. So even if you were holding in landscape like that, or in portrait, you'd only have the one speaker to deal with. Uh, oh, in terms of first impressions, yeah, it feels pretty good in the hands, especially with the textured grippy back. It almost feels like you already have a protective case on it when you don't, so it feels pretty good. Let's see what else is in here. Another layer of cardboard. We discover oh the uh, product code for the Windows registration USB wall adapter for charging and taking a quick look here it is a, a 2 amp uh, charger so I don't know whether the tablet can charge on less than that but it comes with a 2 amp adapter designed for Windows 8 that looks empty. This must be the USB cable. Yeah, that's just the regular USB cable there that you can plug in uh, for charging and maybe for syncing. And then some more basic documentation with your quick start guide and warranty safety regulations. So having a quick look at the, res the quick start. Finally get started, you should turn it on. 
possibly charge it if you need to. Go through the Windows setup process with connecting to a network and creating your account. There's some resources on board for MyDAO and help and registering your tablet. Reminding you to connect to the network so you can use it as a tablet because you'll want the internet and stuff. Uh, this is the Wi-Fi only version, I believe, but there is a uh, LTE HSPA compatible model. So this one didn't look like it had a, a micro SIM slot. It only had the mi micro SD slot. So uh, I guess that's where the empty spot was, where next to the mi micro SD slot that we saw earlier. And I can show that to you again. Uh, nothing too exciting there. Okay, so yeah, where that slot is here, when I open it up, you can see that there's only the micro SD slot. The SIM slot would have been right next door if this was a cellular compatible model. Um, yep, so that's a really quick overview of the Dell Venue 8 Pro Windows 8.1 tablet. Um, that's just the unboxing. The actual full written product review should be up on megatechnews.com in the next little while. I am Michael Kwan for Beyond the Rhetoric. Thanks for watching and uh, be sure to check out the channel and subscribe and like and comment and all that good stuff. I have other unboxing videos, hotel room tours and lots of other great content for you guys to check out. Uh, thanks for tuning in and I'll see you in my next video.